Hi everybody, it is another beautiful warm spring day. It's a little bit windy, but it's still fine. Today we're going to be working in our garden that is in our front yard, which we call our shady garden because it's always shaded. Um, and it's a very nice garden, but it's kind of hard to work with. Yeah, I've had a hard time getting things to grow out here and look really nice. But I'm determined this year to do a better job at making it more beautiful. Okay, so I actually got this beautiful <laughs> rhododendron. You can probably see it. I probably don't need to lift it up. This beautiful rhododendron, um, someone was selling it on Facebook. So I'm so excited that um, I got this big, it's, look, it's like chest height. I got this for $10 this morning, and so I'm so excited. Um, so Scarlett and I have been talking about the different plants that we like to try to put in this garden. And we're going to have this as our main focus. Sorry for the traffic. And we have a few other things. You saw us plant the Lenten roses or the hellebores. I do have a bleeding heart. And I have some pastas that we're going to put in. And I'm thinking I can divide another plant down there. Wow, the traffic is so bad. I'm sorry. Um, it's very distracting, too. Oh, and this is right below the rhododendron. This is a bayberry bush that is coming out. I put this in years ago. It is so spiky. I don't think it's really that beautiful, so I'm getting rid of that. I'm going to need, like, really long gloves to deal with that. Um, what else, sis? I have some Solomon Seal that's brand new. Um, I planted it last fall. So we have that to come up. The hostas. Anything else? I don't think so. So what are we going to do now? Well, we're going to head to the greenhouse to make sure that we have gotten every single plant that likes shade and will look beautiful in our renovated garden. I don't know about every single plant every. that looks good in the shade. I don't <laughs> know if we're going to be able to do that. <laughs> we're going to go and make sure there's nothing else we really want. Oh, yeah. I have some astilbe in here. It's very tiny and it's just coming up, but we do have that too. Remember, we'll do updates and um, we're going to get it planted today. And then we'll update you in a few weeks when everything starts growing. Yeah. I think I forgot to mention ferns. Oh yeah, we have ferns. This is, just follow along. We got this. <laughs> okay, we're back from the greenhouse. It's always fun to go there, isn't it? Oh, it is. So beautiful. Uh -huh. We only got two packs of violas because we were trying to stay focused, okay. even though we looked around a lot. And I'm feeling overwhelmed by this job. We haven't even begun, but we can do it. Yeah. So there's a lot of black plastic down here. If you remember in a previous video, I said that we had laid that down when we redid our landscaping years ago. So I'm thinking we're going to remove the mulch, try to remove that black plastic, and if we can get that done, then we should be smooth sailing to plant. This wind is ferocious. So it's going to take a while. Okay, we'll see what we can get done. Ready? Ready. Let's do it. some harsh spots so little Tootsie is gonna try to dig a hole <laughs> we'll see I was surprised I could do it so see how it goes we're gonna try to put some ferns on either side of the rhododendron Something's actually are up and growing. Yeah, I'm excited. 
Well, thanks for watching, guys. We're going to get this garden watered because we didn't do that yet. Sorry. <laughs> and then I'm taking this girl to get some ice cream. Really? Yeah, she worked so hard. She deserves them. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye. Well, this looks like a spot for a hard worker. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. She chose, what was it called? Um, peanut Butter Park. Peanut Butter Park. Like a peanut butter and chocolatey kind of squirrel. With a waffle cone crunched up, Drizzle. chocolate syrup, and sprinkles. Enjoy, you deserved it. <laughs> Thanks.